Yeah. Let's try to kill you! <laughs> I got work this week. You messing with me. What, put you in the house? What's good, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. We in the kitchen today. No fishing will be done in this video. We just in the kitchen. But we're going to cook some of the fish that we've been catching. Some crappie and some of that trout. So I've been watching a lot of YouTube videos, trying to build up my confidence so I can try to cook the fish in a way that you might not be expecting. So I have some sushi rice. I got some nori seasonings. I got the rice vinegar. I got that Louisiana classic. I got that thing too. We're gonna roll some sushi. All right, so to any of you that ever catch fish, clean them and cook them yourself, you know that the fish have pin bones. I don't wanna worry about the pin bones as I'm trying to eat this crappie or make it into a sushi roll. So all I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take the tail piece or this end right here, cut it into strips along the sides that I know don't have bones. And then the other pieces, I'm gonna throw in a skillet, kind of simmer it, and then I'm gonna break it up like into smaller pieces to get rid of the bones. So for these pieces, I'm just gonna throw them in a skillet, simmer it, and then hopefully be able to just, you know, break it up and get the pin bones out. Y'all know how I do. I'm gonna wing the hell out of this real quick. Put some paprika. So I'm gonna just take some chipotle sauce. That's enough, can't cook without it. Mix it in. Cut this cucumber up into little uh, slices. All right, and I also want some jalapeno. Okay, so update. Broke the crappie up. I didn't find that many bones. Unfortunately, the rice didn't come out how I was planning. I don't know what I did wrong, but, um, it's kind of mushy, but we're gonna make it work. Take a little bit of the rice vinegar and sprinkle it on there. And then we're just gonna, just kind of fold this around, kind of gently, you know, spread it out. Y'all know how I do. We're gonna use it anyway. All right, we're gonna take the Louisiana fish fry, put that in a bag. All right, so what I have here is some cream cheese and sriracha. I'm just gonna mix this up. And then I'm gonna fold the, uh, uh, what do you call this in? The crappie in. Folding it all in. Let's go ahead and fry our crappie. Dump our little fish sticks in there, fish. little crappie strips. Oops. All right, so there's the crappie strips, spicy crappie, cucumbers, uh, jalapeno, diced onions. So I also have some guacamole. I wanted some avocado to go inside, but I couldn't find any. So yeah. Let's start building. Nori, place it on the cutting board like so. I don't know if it matters what side you put up. Then I'm gonna wet my fingers a little bit. 
What my hands? Take some uh, sushi rice. Just kind of place it on there. Not too much. I'll put it up there. I need some more water on my fingers. So you you add the water on your hands so that the rice will come off easier. Just kind of spread it down. That's pretty ugly, but we're gonna go with it. It's the first roll. All right. Take the sesame. Seeds. I like a lot of sesame seeds. Okay. Now you take the paper, flip it, flap, flip them like that, and then now you start building it. Some cucumber. Maybe not too much cucumber. So we're gonna do two strips of cucumber. Jalapeno. Jalapeno there, jalapeno there, jalapeno there. Imitation crab. Get a little scoop, scoopity scoop, spread it out. I mean, not imitation crab, this is uh, the crappie. Put some green onion in here too. A little more green onion with a little bit of this guac. Little dollop, little dollop of the guacamole. Now we're going to roll it, kind of tuck it like a burrito, I guess. Like this, whoop de whoop, and just roll it like a burrito. Like so, okay. That is uh, very ugly, but <laughs> it's all right. Forget it. Yeah, we're just gonna do a roll. Take this thing, lay it over it, and just kind of squeeze it. Uh oh, I may have squeezed it a little too tight. Oh. That's a little juicy right there. You'll see. Mmm. Mmm. Okay. Clearly need better knife skills. This is <laughs> not as clean as it should be. Now let's take the ceram wrap off. Like so, okay. I'm gonna take these rolls, place it there. Pretty ugly, but let's keep it going. Get a good handful of the rice. Rice on the paper, kind of spread it out. Down the paper. Rice on the paper. Down the paper. Flippity flip. All right, so let's go cucumber. Jalapeno down, get the fried crappie, a little spicy crappie, a little green onion. All right, now let's roll it. No guac. Like the burrito. Just tuck him in. A little tuck, a little tuck, tuck. Tuck, tuck, tuck. Tuck, tuck, tuck. 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 All right, I'm gonna take it, squeeze it. Okay, okay. I don't got the slicing skill, so I'm just gonna smash it down. Bring it back to shape with this. Dip it again. Not so bad. All right, so we are done. I didn't realize how much work freaking sushi is. And it was a, it was a little messy, but it's time to try it out. But this is the first try, so I'm gonna try. I got some camera women here. My sister, my niece, my friend Shonda, who hooked up my logo and she, what else, do, what do you do? Graphic design. She says graphic design. Graphic design. 
Huh? Clothing design. Clothing design. I'll just tag you in her uh, Instagram <laughs> and you can see what, what she working with. Okay. All right. So let's try. Crystal, you can try this. This is the crappie fried and I made some freaking, oh, this is just a potle mayo and that's some soy sauce. So this one right here has um, basically like a California roll, but with the um, crappie, like a spicy crappie instead. So who's going first? Not me. Go Shonda. Okay. Go Shonda. What are we eating? So I'll just, oh, we got jalapeno in it. Okay, that's okay. Okay, so this one has, you could probably dip it too. That one has a combination of the, I'm not sure. Yeah, it's gonna need a little sauce. So it's cucumber, jalapeno, uh, the fried, uh, fried crappie, and the little mix of crappie. I'm gonna do a little spicy mayo. Okay. Like that. Mm -hmm. It's good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm using a fork, y'all. I don't know why she did. She go right. <laughs> It's cooked. It's not I'm nothing's not raw. She doesn't like raw fish, but everything is cooked. It, I think the name sushi. She don't like the seaweed. Either. Oh, you like seaweed? Okay. <laughs> Just try the 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 crappie by itself. My sister is very dramatic. She is very dramatic. <laughs> I wish she was on camera. Spit it out. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> this girl is something. Okay, try this one. I'll make sure. This All one's right. different? Uh, it, ju it just has um, no no fried crappie in it. This, what kind of, it's... That's spicy mayo. Uh, chipotle mayo. No, no, sorry. Uh -oh. There's fried crappie that. and there's... It's, it's mayo. Oh, they got my uh, This one, I just went... Uh, imagine Paris in the hungry roll. Just went a little heady with it. So this one got uh, that avocado, that guacamole. Like, is it cream cheese in one of these? A little bit. Which one have cream cheese? The one I just ate. Yeah. Let's <laughs> <laughs> kill you! <laughs> I gotta work this week. You messing with me? What? Put you in the hospital? No. But I can't go to work if I'm. Oh, no. Spewing out of both ends, can I? Oh, I'm sorry. Just a little bit. <laughs> Just a little bit. Get you messed up. Yes. I got sick from someone not changing their gloves before they made my food once. There will be so naturally cheese in food. So okay. you're allergic to this? I have a lactose allergy. That's what I call it because it makes me very sick. It was at this moment that he knew. He <laughs> <laughs> I only have a bite, so like maybe it won't kill me. I'm sorry, I didn't know you was, uh, I didn't know what, what your uh, deal was. Yeah, lactose is the only thing I can't have that's not from choice. Everything else is by choice. What is I mayo? I mean, beef and pork makes me sick too, but not really. Mayo is egg and oil. Just be safe. I don't want to grab one of them. All right, so let me let me try myself. All right, get a little dippity dip. Some just some soy sauce. I like it. So far, it looks like it was a success. Actually, it wasn't too hard. It was just something new, and I need to have more. I need to have a sharper knife so I can cut through the, the rolls easier. And. Overall, it, it turned out pretty good. And then as you watch the video, leave me some tips on what I should have done or shouldn't have done. And then maybe I'll think about practicing it next time. But as you guys know, I usually just wing it, depending on how I feel in the moment anyway. 
So with that said, thanks for watching. Please like, share, subscribe, leave a comment down below. And like always, if I don't see you, you'll... you okay? Uh, pray, for, <coughs> pray for Shonda. Uh, I don't think she's supposed to have any dairy and uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Thanks for watching. <laughs> Peace out.